cities are in the forefront of this uh, climate change impacts because uh, the settlements of population, uh, most of these settlements are in coastal areas or are in, uh, in, uh, in determined in the past uh, by history through uh, uh, easy access to water, uh, to water resources. So either uh, we are in the, in the scenario of too much water to floods or uh, increase in, in, uh, in, the, in the level of oceans or in the case of uh, not enough uh, water through uh, the, the issues of, of droughts, you know, the cities will be in the forefront. Now, the cities can do a lot of things, a lot of things, and because a lot of uh, uh, this combination of uh, different policies together to address the problems actually need to be done at the city level. But if there is no uh, a sort of a, a context, uh, an environment, uh, provided by uh, regional, uh, by uh, central governments, and in, in, even by supranational governments like uh, we have in Europe, uh, we cannot address, uh, you know, fully the problem. For example, it's very difficult for a city to uh, compensate for the fact that we don't have uh, a price on carbon emissions. The price on carbon emissions is the most obvious economic, economic instrument to induce every economic a agent to uh, tackle, incorporate, interiorize in some sense this problem of, uh, of climate change. If you don't have this perimeter in place, it's very difficult for a city to compensate for the lack of this, uh, of this instrument. The same, uh, you know, when you talk, for example, about investment, uh, a, a lot of the investment in cities is conditioned by uh, the transfers of revenues coming from central governments because of course you know as the country level there is this redistribution of uh, fiscal resources um, across uh, across the different regions and uh, and cities it's it's also difficult sometimes to undertake these investments at the city level because regional governments local governments are constrained to borrow money by uh, in some sense contracts or laws uh, that uh, that are decided uh, by the central government, right? And uh, and uh, when you have a problem in terms of your uh, local finances, the most easy thing to adjust is your investment. And most of the public investment, in particular in the water, is done by these subnational governments. It's not done by national uh, governments.